Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Armenia is under constant threat as a part of Collective Security Treaty Organization CSTO which includes Armenia, Belarus, Kazakhstan, Kyrgyzstan, Russia and Tajikistan. Russia is supposed to protect Armenia. As per Article 4 of the Security Treaty establishes that an aggression against one signatory would be perceived as an aggression against all. However, Russia is busy or may be called stuck in Ukraine war and none of the Western countries are standing up to the Armenia who is facing constant threat from three brothers. The trio is Azerbaijan, Turkey and Pakistan. We are all aware how Turkey and its supplied armed drones have helped Azerbaijan in the conflict with Armenia. Tensions between Armenia and Azerbaijan has continued to mount. Azerbaijani officials have continued to issue threats to Armenia about the possibility of further escalation. Now to handle its existing challenges and threats, Armenia is looking towards India for the latest weapons. Earlier, India had supplied Shwati WLR that is weapon locating radar to Armenia. Back in March 2020, Swati radar has outperformed Russia and Poland's radar in trials conducted to win defense deal worth $40 million. India has supplied four sets of Swati radars as a part of this deal. You may find many trolls on social media claiming that Swati WLR did not help Armenia during the war with Azerbaijan. However, it's a fake propaganda. The delivery of Shwati WLR started after the ceasefire of the conflict over Nagorno-Karabakh region. To be precise, it commenced from 25th January 2021 and the ceasefire between Armenia and Azerbaijan was agreed on 10th November 2020. Now, as per the recent report from Economic Times, Armenia had signed a government-to-government -government deal worth rupees. 2000 crore with India for the import of missiles, rockets and ammunition. As part of this deal, India will supply Pinaka multi-barrel rocket launch to Armenia. This is going to be the first export order for Pinaka. Besides Pinaka, India will also supply the anti-tank missiles and the range of ammunition. In recent few years, Indian government has been pushing heavily towards the export of defense hardware. The defense exports have grew by 334% in the last 5 years and India is now exporting towards 75 countries due to collaborative efforts. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.